hey good afternoon we are at it again we're actually at a a different lake we come over to buoy to get some groceries and i thought you know i got a few hours to burn i'm gonna bring my boat and uh so we are at Eamon g carter lake we're gonna do some exploring try to find some, some crappie and uh and just just see what we can find in a couple two or three hours so don't have a clue where to start i, I say that there was a nice gentleman here named mike that was leaving and he was nice enough to show me a couple spots to try and i'm gonna hit them but i'm gonna do some exploring too so pretty excited about that um like i said i'm targeting crappie i didn't even bring a bass rod we'll probably end up this fall coming to us bass fishing maybe but we're pretty excited to try something new try something else out uh, looks looks pretty promising here so we'll give it a shot i'll watch you in a minute well, I'm finding crappie at these little poles, but I don't know if they're just babies or they're not hungry. They're, they're bumping my jig, but I'm just not getting, just not getting the sauce. Gotta get, find something that gives the sauce. That gun, I thought I had that one. I think they're just babies, man. Finally pulled one off, folks. I worked pretty hard to get this fish. On my third, on my third stop. Like he's gonna be about ten and a half inches, but I'm gonna double check him just, just to be fair. Yep, just like we thought. Okay. Woo, man, you talking about glad to get the skunk out of the boat? We are glad to do that, and we got a little. Come on. Got a little fish sent on a lure, and that always helps. I'm telling you, that, that makes a big difference. So. Got a little pile of them on the graph. I don't know if y'all can see there or not. Right there. Looks good. You can see, I think it's just a tree limb or a stump coming up. It's cloudy around it. Maybe harder fish than I thought it was going to be today since kind of got a little front that moved in. I don't know if it's changing the, the barometric pressures out a little bit, but I'm glad to be on a new lake and finally got a fish in the boat. So it's a good day. We'll keep messing with them. There's a fish. Oh, he got off. Dad gummit. Thought we had another one. We're gonna try the John Anderson technique. Just a swinging. We'll swing into that brush pile. They're piled up in there pretty good. Like I said, new lake. Want to try something different. <clears throat> I like what I've seen so far. Uh, obviously, like I said, I don't know if he's barometric pressures are messing with the fish or not a good time zone who knows or the fish that's gonna be a keeper oh god man man that's a good keeper too boy yeah man they seem to like the chartreuse better than paint for sure. Swing them on in here. There's some more, there's some good fish on there. We just gotta give them the sauce. Where's the sauce? Oh, 
fish. A little bit better fish up there. Hope I got him hooked good. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. It's a good fish right there, folks. <laughs> good fish on a new lake. Heck yes. That's what we're talking about. We got us a fishing video, folks. There's the fish. I don't know if he's a keeper. There's a fish. The more I handle him, the more I handle him, the more I don't think he's a keeper. get one more keeper here and move on i think there's gonna be some more brush but i, I, I still see some good fish on this right here on the grass They shrink them. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. They, I don't need a scale measure for that one. <laughs> we don't need to measure that one. We don't need no measure for that sucker. Tell you they're down there. Oh, this is a good fish here. Ooh, 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 ooh. Holy smokes! <laughs> Look at that song gone. Look at that song gone. Oh my gosh! Look at that. Ain't as big as a cooler lid. Huh? Wow. Wow. I d was not expecting that. That floored me right there, folks. I had to text my, my fishing friends, Matt and Tammy. She loves it when I send her fishing pictures. I think I get called an asshole every now and then. Right if I... I'm figuring out and it's hard it's hard but it, I'm thinking these figs these fish aren't liking a lot of movement this jig oh that's a good fish that's another good fish <laughs> You're scaring, you're scaring your buddies off. Quit. You're scaring your buddies off. Don't you want to be with your buddies? Let's get you in. A, let's get you in here. And we'll get you get some more buddies with you. Get you in the cooler. We'll get you some more buddies. Yeah. See there? There's some friends. Tell you what, these 4B baits have been really good baits. I it 
it took me a little bit but i got on them now i really like them they got good colors seem to be a good hardy bait you can get multiple multiple fishes off of them pretty happy so far with the results of this little lit trip we got some piles marked and heck we ain't been we ain't been far at all out here Fish. There's a good one too. I don't know if he's gonna keep. Measure slimy. That's either a good or a bad thing. Feels like a good one. I don't believe it is. I'm not even gonna. I'm not even gonna wrestle him to measure him. Come here. Let's let's get you off here safely. Without doing any harm to either one of us. Another little one. Getting more consistent though with the. The swinging technique. Mm. Mm. Ah. Boy, he's gonna be borderline keeper. He was a borderline keeper. I'd like to get my scales on him. Need another one of them big old mamas like we pulled out of that first brush pile. I may spin around here and try that place again before we take off and start looking. We're gonna measure him, but I think he's a 10 and a half inch fish himself. He's getting smaller by the second though. find this lake's got a bunch i say but it don't take long to find someone find one i think this is going to be a pile of small ones on this log right here oh, what, you, what do you know we got a small one Come on, give them the sauce. We know you're down there. We are right in the middle of them, right there. Huh. Come on, I know you want the sauce. Take the sauce. We'll try that chartreuse color, see if it don't. I'm, I'm really liking this two color combo. Try the chartreuse, they kind of die off on it, then we throw the pink at them. When, the, when they won't wink at the pink, we go back to chartreuse. Pretty simple, folks. I, might. I don't know, it's kind of like deer hunting. When you get them in the boat, they start shrinking on you. I just don't know. I know he don't. I know he don't. I know it. Hold on. I just gotta get a look though. Nope. Nine and three quarter. Hey, we got a winner. Mm. Dang. Why do they do that to me? 
I just don't understand it. And that would look like a keeper. I know it was a keeper. That's 11 inch crappie. God, dog it. Come on, we try. We got some new sauce for them. A little white sauce. They seem to be hitting it. Pretty good. Ah, that's what I wanted right there. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I think we got to. Don't shrink on me. Don't. I don't want ground shrinkage. No ground shrinkage on this one. I think we got ground shrinkage. Gosh. Dang. Thought we had to keep it. Thought we had to keep it. But I don't know. Know why you just can't get in there and settle down and hush and let me measure you, you nine and quarter crappie. Hey, this one got some weight to it. We got, we got, a, got a keeper, got a keeper, got a keeper, got a keeper, keeper crappie. And then the ground shrinking starts in. I don't think this ain't gonna shrink. It's gonna be a 10 inch crop for sure. It ain't gonna be a 10 inch crop for sure if you don't scare all this freeze off wet. 10 inch crop. Fish. That may be a good one right there, boys. That is a good one. Pretty easily 11 inch fish. Good fish there too. Some good fish out there too. Biggin. Trying a new lake out today, and I think it's I think it's gonna work out. It's not very far, about a 25 minute drive from the house. Not a bad gig. Well, I guess probably yeah, about 25 minutes. Not a bad gig. Well, we're gonna be back over here. Cause heck, we ain't we hadn't covered any ground at all over here. We haven't done bad. I figure we give it time enough. That's a pretty dog. Got some pretty whiskey barrel flowers on it. I kind of like this old lake. I think we'll. I think we'll be back. Thank y'all for watching, buddy. Feed TV. And thank you for going on this adventure with us. And sure had a good time.